this is the border. I'm crossing the bridge here. It's uh, newly built. The construction work is still on, and people are using uh, the border bikes. Uh, they call it the uh, Ojak, which in Indonesian means a um, uh, motorbike ride to the border. As you can see, the construction work has been opened. Uh, the actual the opening of the bridge was yesterday, and uh, they continue to doing the uh, maintenance and also the completion of the bridge. As soon as it's done, the border is free. The trade is going on, and people are expected to move to and from this bridge and to the border and to Indonesia. So there's someone from Batas coming down. Hello, good morning. Yeah, and also the bridge is very fine. And there's someone waiting to uh, put on the object. Uh, this guy's gonna take me to the border, and it's ready. Uh, Let's go, buddy. You see the light there? Check the light, uh, brother. been opened recently so we will expect a lot of activities going on this Indonesian border and the uh, Papua New Guinea border uh, in Vanema. I just came here and then I'd like to cross the border but unfortunately this time you will have to have a visa, valid visa. Uh, for tourists, people like me, I have to pay 300 plus to get uh, 30 days or rather 60 days visa. When I was a student, we used to use um, a student visa and it was on arrival, but this time not like the case we used to do that before, but you left to get a visa from either in Vanima or at what must be a Bessie. Um, there's some traditional lending for the issues, yes, you left to have a green card or yellow card from the Vanima Provincial Administration. So the traditional land crosses should have that cut at ten before crossing. Uh, there is no such thing as just cross, go shopping and then come back. No, this is not one now. As from today, this is an update from Vanimo, PNG border and Uto. Thank you.
The border crosses are coming back from Jaipura or the market uh, here. Yeah.